What's up everybody, Sebastian here and in this video we are going to be doing Moon and Scorpio. Now, I did a whole bunch of Moon and Scorpio videos in the past, so check them out. But since this is the astrology series where I upload all 12 signs before New Year, we're going to be doing Moon and Scorpio again and kind of touching it from a different point of view. Alright? So, Scorpio. Fixed water. I'm a winning Scorpio, so I, I can explain this exact moon sign in detail. You guys, Scorpio moons, you're either happy and you're sad. You're feeling 24 7 your emotions and overthinking everything. Everything. The Scorpio moon overthinks everything. You can say hello and a few hours later even, they'll still be thinking about it. This person said hello to me, but they were kind of mad. They, they had this look on their face, like, they overanalyze stuff like that, you know. Scorpio moons, they're also of deeply investigators. They remember every single thing you said to them and exactly how you made them feel. Let's say for example you, you get that moon Scorpio the other day and you think, huh, oh, they're over it. No, they remember exactly how you made them feel that day. Okay? They remember everything, every single thing. Okay? Uh, they have no problem cutting you out of their life like this here. Easily. Easily. You might be like, I don't even were friends, I, I was just joking. That motherfucker's gone. You can't even get a hold of him. They cut you out of their life like that. Like, really invisible. Moon and Scorpios, they'd rather have one-on-one -on -one conversations than having a conversation with a group of people as they really want to get to know a person on a deep level. They hate, they really, really hate middle surface conversations. They want to, they, they know they have to investigate you so deeply to the point where you will share your embarrassing stuff with the moon and Scorpio. They know how to get under your skin and get all of just the secret information of you. They, they, they know how to use special tactics to get to know you better. So it's, it's for example, you're staying middle surface, like, oh, da 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 blah, 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 blah. They know how to dig very, very deep and get to the cause. They're constantly thinking about death. They're very, very dark. And they overthink everything. And love to have be peaceful. Yet yeah, when they're too peaceful, they will find a way to create drama because they can't live with peace. They love drama. They love acting. They're very, very good actors. Moon and Scorpio know how to play a character either angry, happy, or sad as that's how the emotions are. It's not like happy, sad, angry, happy, sad. It's more happy, angry, sad. So it's like they know how to put themselves in a different point of view of a different person and act that character out to the extreme. They have the most intense emotions of the whole zodiac. When they want a relationship, they want commitment. They will never commit to you unless they think that you're ready. That you're the perfect one for them. They only trust a few people on this universe. And they only share that specific information to a special few on this universe. Because they don't want to feel betrayed 
and they are very, very scared of people knowing to wield them. Yet yeah, they are very, very good at getting to know someone on a deeper level. And that person might think, oh, this Scorpio Moon is telling everything about them. Very deep, oh my gosh. I'll share everything with them. But in reality, there's still a bit of information of Moon Scorpio that they didn't share with you. That they do keep private. Alright, so be careful of that. Okay? So if you enjoyed my video, feel free to drop a like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends if you enjoyed, and peace out.